Hey, it's Scott Warner, Cruise Consulting, and today I'm answering the question, how do SaaS companies recognize revenue on contracts that are annual and billed and collected up front? This is a very common question. The answer is you always want to use accrual gap-based accounting, and you always want to recognize that revenue on a monthly basis as you provide the service over the year. It doesn't matter if you collected the cash up front. If you booked it that way, that would be called cash accounting. That's not accrual. That's not the right way to do things for startups. That's not the way that VCs, that's not the way that corporate development offices, they don't view your financials that way. They don't want to see your financials that way. They want to see them on an accrual basis every time. And it's better for management and for the investors. Imagine you're sitting in a board meeting and you haven't been booking your reoccurring revenue stream on a monthly basis and your revenue, because it's on cash, is bouncing all around. And the board is freaking out because they invest in a SaaS company thinking this is going to be a smooth, long build. And you put up a zero this month, right? Like that, that is going to, people are going to lose their minds. So you're going to take a lot of grief if your revenue is not booked correctly. And imagine when you go through an M&A, like if the corporate development group or the accounting firm that they hire due diligence on you is looking at this and it's cash accounting, again, bouncing all over, not consistent, not SaaS like. They're gonna want, they're gonna be worried that they're working or buying a company that isn't run by a super sophisticated team. They're also gonna be worried that the accounting firm that you're using is not doing their job correctly. And the next natural step is, well, what else is wrong? What else do I not know about? What am I? What's lurking beneath the surface here in this M and A deal? And it, the, it it could literally make the deal fall apart. It could make them give you a haircut. There's a lot of bad things that can happen. So do your revenue recognition correctly. Work with a CPA firm that knows what they're doing that will be there for you during diligence and always book this stuff on a monthly basis as you earn the revenue, as you deliver the service. It doesn't matter if you collect the cash up front, although that's really good for mitigating your burn. So definitely try to collect up front if possible. Hope that helps. If you have any questions on revenue recognition, SaaS companies, hit us up at cruiseconsulting.com. And hey, while you're on our YouTube channel, if you don't mind clicking the old subscribe button, we'd appreciate it. We put a lot of time and energy into these videos and uh, hope you see more of them. Thanks.